Okay, so why is Bulletproof Coffee important while doing keto? So hey, new video. This video is going back to an old basic keto thing for me at least. And this is the Bulletproof Coffee. A lot of people are still kind of confused because someone asked me to do this video. So I'm gonna do it. The ingredients are real simple. All you need is... If you want a more in-depth explanation of Bulletproof Coffee, I did it in a previous video and I'll put the link down below. So those are like adjustable to your taste. Don't have to get this brand of coffee, but get some kind of coffee, whatever heavy whipping cream you want. MCT oil, I got this from Costco. I got two of these for like $20, which is really good because when I first got it, I got it from GNC. It was only one bottle for like $20, so if you get some, go to Costco and get it. Sweetener is up to you. I use these because it makes the coffee taste better. I'm not really a coffee fan, so um, these make it taste sweeter for me than just a regular sweetener. And I got the, I got this from um, Marshalls. So you can go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, they have like these and like their little food snack section. And the butter does not have to be salted. You can get unsalted or whatever. I had some um, sweet cream butter before. So whatever kind of butter you would like to use, you can use that. So I'm gonna go over this a little bit, just to let people know like kind of what it is, why you, why you should drink it. Especially since I've been doing keto for a little while now. So you know, I'm a little bit more in the understanding and the know of um, Bulletproof Coffee. So yeah. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is how I make the Bulletproof Coffee, my way of making it. So Okay, so first thing I do is get one tablespoon of butter, whatever kind of butter you choose cut that i like to put it into my cup before i pour the coffee because that helps the, bu the butter melt faster so put that in next thing i do put the coffee in let it brew. So after that's brewed, get your heavy whipping cream. I like to just pour, but you should put about two tablespoons of heavy whipping cream in. MCT oil, about the same amount, one and a half to two. And then the sweetener you pour to your taste. So you're gonna see the first time I make it, I don't put enough. And then I'm gonna add some more and it tastes great. some separation like with the fats all the fats will go to the top so don't worry about that that's normal i have my nice see-through cup i have a lot of these little starbucks cups i got around christmas time but yeah but you can see the separation even when you do the tea it'll be some type of separation because the mct oil and the fat is in there so they always like rise to the top so just give it a little swirl okay and then it'll um, go back down so yeah, don't worry about that. That's normal. Okay, so why is Bulletproof Coffee important while doing keto? So Bulletproof Coffee is important while doing keto as far as I know because it helps um, your hunger. So if you like really, really hungry and you drink this coffee, it'll really like slow your hunger way, way down. Like it's been times where I haven't eaten for like, so many hours like six hours or something because i was drinking this coffee wasn't hungry i was cool like the mct oil the butter the coffee help you to feel full so you know you're not eating as much i did a beef and butter fast before for four days and three days i did it and no no, no. one the first day i did it i um drunk coffee the second day I did it, I didn't drink any coffee. I just drank some tea, like a Starbucks drink or something. So the first day, I lost weight. Cool. Second day, I was still kind of like the same. So I was like, okay, well, the fast says drink the coffee. So let me follow the instructions, right? So every day I was drinking the coffee, it was helping me like drop 
pounds like when I drank it with the beef and butter fast like so coffee is really well the excuse me the bulletproof coffee is really good like to curb your hunger when you're on keto and it has so much fat in it so it helps to like start your day off with fats also if you're fasting I drink bulletproof coffee because it's no carbs in it so I drink bulletproof coffee you can do bulletproof tea if you want to it's essentially the same thing I just don't put cream in mine I just put the butter and the um, MCT oil. That's really it. But tea, I don't know if it's as effective as the Bulletproof coffee, but you know, you could try it. My mom, she drinks the tea because she's not a coffee drinker. So if you're not a coffee drinker, then the tea would be better for you. I've done it before. It works. It actually tastes really good to me. Last week, I have like some peach tea or something. It's really, really good from Lipton. But um, yeah, any kind of tea, coffee, whatever will work because they don't have any carbs. The sweetener. That's why I use the liquid one because I was using stevia, stevias before and they um, have carbs in it. Like I think one carb, like each little sugar packet of stevia has carbs. So that's why I was like, okay, well, my friend, she got me some of the little Jordan bad syrup I have. It's called Jordan Skinny Syrup. So that's the kind I've been using like from now on because it's so good. And then even I made my own pink drink, the keto pink drink from Starbucks. I make it at my house. And I use the vanilla from that. Like it tastes really like it's just good and like different aspects of drinks that you can use. So and it's no carbs, no sugar, nothing. So yeah, so that's pretty much it for this video. Just a simple video because some people was confused about how to make it, like what is it for or anything. So if you have any questions about it that I did not answer in this video, please make sure you leave a comment down below. Like if you like this video. Subscribe to me so you can get more keto videos every Friday. So yeah. And if anybody's wondering about my hair, because I think it looks so luxurious and great today. Um, this hair is from Yummy Hair. Beautiful. Very cute. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going to drink this coffee. And that's it. Hope you have a good rest of your day. What's today? What's coming up? Um, Fourth of July is coming up soon. So, get your keto bodies ready for the pool and the fireworks and everything. So, yeah. So, have a good day. I'm about to finish this coffee. And that's it. All right. See you guys later. Bye. Yeah.